Good morning, everyone. This is Coffee and Prayer with Joyce B. Sharing the Word of God. Today, I'm sharing 2 Kings 8, all the way to verse 1 to 29. Remember, the Lord Jesus Christ loves you, and He is watching over you. Before I begin sharing the Word of God, I would like to say a prayer for each and every one of you who's watching this video, stopping by to say hello, comment, saying amen. I appreciate each and every one of you, but most of all, Jesus Christ the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit appreciates each and every one of you for taking the time and making that faith step by coming by just to see the Word of God and to hear the Word of God. In Jesus' name, amen. Now let's begin to pray. Father God, I ask of you in Jesus' name, bless everyone that's watching this video today. Bless everyone in every area of their life. Today they're coming to you for something that they need, Father God. And I ask of you, Father God, give it to them. I ask you, Father God, in Jesus' name. And your word says, whatsoever I ask in Jesus' name, it shall be done. So, Father God, I ask you in Jesus' name, bless everyone today who's watching this video or just passing by or just passing through or just skipping it, even if they just glance at your word, just glance at it. I want you to catch their attention and I want you to bless them. Whatever they're, they're asking you, whatever, whatever need they have right now, oh Lord God, let it be done for each and every one. Because they took that that time, that step. Even I mean, even if they just passed over the work, just let it catch on to them. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. This is this is coffee and prayer with Joyce B with the word of God. Remember Jesus loves you. And now I'm gonna to get to the word because the word is what I wanna put out there. It's important that you see God's word. His word is full of blessings. And when the word come upon you, you will know it. It's right here. It's right here. The blessing is right here in front of you. When you see the Bible, the blessings in the Bible is going to come on you. When you open the Bible, it's going to come on you. Even in the video, the blessings, the spirit of the Lord is going to come upon you. And that's when blessings will come into your life. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Let the blessings come into everyone's life right now, Father God. In Jesus' name, let it be done. And your word says, whatsoever I ask in Jesus' name. It shall be done. Always ask in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. The word of God is so beautiful. Whew. <laughs> he, 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 he gets you all shook up. I'm all shook up for the Lord. Mm -hmm. Yes, I'm so shook up for the Lord. Mm -hmm. Saying, tell me, I uh -huh. pray thee all the great things. See, when you pray, Prayer is power. Look what God can do. The blessings are here. The blessings are here. He can restore everything that you lost. He can restore that. That's right. That's right. That's what this verse is about right here. On um, 8, chapter 8 and 6, that's what he's saying. He can restore us. And when the king asked that the woman, she what? She was... Uh, a certain officer saying, Restore all that was uh -huh, hers and all the fruits of the field since the day that she left the land, even until now. You see, God let everything is restored to her. Uh, everything was restored to her. See, her home, her house was restored to her. Yeah. He can restore anything. He restore her house, her land. Hallelujah. See? Restore. That's what God can do. That's what this is verse is for. This is chapter 8. So you read it. Receive it. That so Father God, restore what everyone need. What restore whatever they lost. Let it be given. Hallelujah. Look, look, right here, see. King said, uh -huh. God, by him, mm -hmm. see, shall I recover of this disease, huh? See, restore, God can restore everything, God can restore all your health, uh, whatever journey you're going through today, ask God to restore 
whatever you need, okay, whatever you lost, something that you, you said, I don't, I don't have this, God will restore it, I lost this, God will restore it, he would give you that land, he would give you back that house, he would give you that land, that's what he's saying, your health, he will restore, hallelujah, thank you Jesus, that's what the verse right here is saying, and here we go, I'm going to tell you right here, I want y'all to see this, look, Sent me to the saying, Shall I recover all of this disease? Shall I recover of this disease? All right, let's go on. I'm just sharing the word of God. Uh, second Kings 8, all the way to 29. Sorry, my, my phone keeps going in a different direction. <laughs> Trying to hold it with one hand. Take my hand. I don't want y'all to see something. I don't want y'all to miss it. I want you to get all the blessings of the Lord. And that's what this verse, this chapter is saying. It's about restoring, okay? Restore your house. Restore your car. Money. Restore your money. Land. Okay? I see that? God loves you. Remember that. Jesus Christ loves you. And he is absolutely watching over you. And I'm sharing today. Kings 8. And uh, chapter 8 all the way to. Right here. 29. And I finished. Got to go up here. All right. I don't want y'all to miss it. You can always pause to to read you know, the whole. Let y'all see something right here first. Well, that's son of what? Judas. Because he was sick. Now, that chapter 9, I'm going to be sharing that one coming out. I don't. All right. Okay, everybody, <laughs> this is Coffee and Prayer, sharing the Word of God. And I want you to know that Jesus Christ appreciates you, and He loves you. He will guide you the right direction to go. Stay in prayer with the Lord Jesus Christ. Continue to pray daily, and let your relationship with God, you know, become stronger each day. He will restore the relationships in your life. He will restore what you need. And what you lost in prayer. Right now, let's pray for everyone to have to restore whatever they lost. Father God, restore whatever everyone has lost. Restore if they lost uh, their home, their, uh, their house, their land, a car. Let it be restored. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. The Lord Jesus Christ is watching over you. He loves you. Ask him to guide you. Ask you to guide him. You to him to guide you in every area of your life. Say, Father God, guide me. Guide me. Be my guide, O oh Lord. And he will guide you to the right direction. Say, Father God, I come to you in Jesus' name right now. Guide me to the right direction. In Jesus' name, amen. Restore me. Restore all. Restore all to me. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. See, that's what... This chapter is about restore. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Always give thanks to the Lord. It's important to do that because when you're thankful before you even receive your need, ooh, that opens the door of blessing, of answers, of yes. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Okay, everybody. This is Coffee and Prayer with Joyce B. singing, Jesus Christ loves you.